The search for a suspect in a standoff continues this afternoon. Police say the man likely escaped before SWAT officers set up a perimeter around a home on the north side. Good afternoon and welcome to those of you watching on CBS in Pittsburgh. I'm Stacy Smith. The situation began late this morning and it has now been going on for several hours. Megan Schiller joins us live now along West North Avenue with the latest. Megan. Stacy, the search for that suspect continues right now. No suspect description to release, but it all happened at the home. The row homes behind me in this Manchester section of the north side. It all started just before noon. A female social worker with CYF went into the home just trying to do her job. She said she wanted to check on the children inside, and that's when a man inside allegedly assaulted her. A single file line of SWAT officers rushed inside the home. Nearby officers posted up on tactical trucks, guns drawn. The CYF uh, official called 911 after she was assaulted by a male inside while trying to perform her duties. The CYF worker escaped this row home with one seven year old child, but police say the suspect stayed behind with a two year old and an adult female. They called for a, a female and a two-year-old and they were escorted outside the house. Uh, K-9 and SWAT did go through the house and did not find the mail. All that and no suspect, but the children are safe tonight. Family members hugged on the sidewalk while SWAT officers debriefed in the front yard. And thankfully, no children hurt, no officers hurt. Again, we will continue reaching out to Pittsburgh police to figure out if they do have a suspect description or a name that they want us to pass along. As soon as we have that information, we, of course, will let you know. Reporting live in Manchester, Megan Schiller, KDK News.